The Spokane Valley Company isn't even a year old, but it's already busy servicing a growing list of customers. American Metal Fabrication and Welding opened in January. Derek Dice gives us a look at what it can do in Made in the Northwest. Inside this shop in Spokane Valley, American Metal Fabrication and Welding can do just about anything you want with metal. You name it, if, if you can dream it, we can probably build it. And if we can't, we know people to work with to help us do it for you. American Metal Fabrication and Welding is a partnership between Aaron Meldrum and longtime friend Brandon Blasberg, who owns American CNC Fabricating right next door, which we featured on Made in the Northwest in 2017. Just a perfect opportunity for us to collaborate together, get going on more of a metal fabrication side. To get going, AMFW immediately invested in new equipment like this plasma cutter. The CNC plasma cutter would give us capabilities of cutting up to three quarter inch thick plate steel. They also bought a saber saw to process large steel pieces and picked up a Scotchman iron worker as well. Really will expand our capabilities as far as processing material in a quicker fashion, um, shearing, punching holes, um, stuff like that. And as the name suggests, it's also a full weld shop. MIG, TIG, welding, uh, mild steel, stainless steel, aluminum. We also have you know, oxyacetylene, so if we have to do some plate burning, we can do that as well. Right now, a lot of the work at AMFW is in decorative metal signs. They even made this sign for our radio co-workers at Rock 94 and a half. Meldrum would like to do more work in outdoor living spaces, like with this outdoor metal fire pit topper that he sent to landscape companies. They've actually seem very interested. They just need to get the customer uh, that wants that metal look in their you know, outdoor landscape. AMFW has also done some work on vehicles. It's even made this keg rack for a brewery and various other projects. Jack of all trades right now. The growing amount of projects has Meldrum confident in the future, saying he thinks they'll soon need a bigger facility and more toys too. You know, we'll probably be looking at eventually getting a laser, uh, laser cutting machine so we can do all that. Expanding its capabilities and expanding its volume of work with metal. For Maine the Northwest, I'm Derek Dice, 4 News Now.